As concerns about E. coli rise in Knox County, four children remain in serious condition. East Tennessee Children's Hospital says it's seen close to 10 children under the age of four test positive for that bacteria in the past week and a half. That prompted the Knox County Health Department to issue an E. coli alert. The health department and Children's Hospital both warn against drinking raw milk. This story has prompted a lot of questions and concerns from viewers and reporter Stephanie Haynes joins us now with some answers in this 10 listens report. Stephanie. John, bottom line, health drinking raw milk is just not worth the risk. Some of you asked on Facebook, so now I can't eat lettuce or drink milk and experts say no, it's OK to drink pasteurized milk, but you shouldn't drink raw or unpasteurized milk. Pasteurizing means heating the milk up to kill off the bacteria. I spoke with the Knox County Health Department, a nutritionist, a veterinarian, a dairy immunologist and the East Tennessee Children's Hospital. All of those, along with the CDC and the American Academy of Pediatrics, say drinking unpasteurized milk comes with serious health risks. And in fact, Children's Hospital and other health workers say children should not at any time drink raw milk. The risk of milk-borne disease from consuming raw milk is real, and there is never a time when you want to expose a child to that risk. There is never a time when children should be consuming raw milk or raw milk products. Now, we saw some of you comment that you grew up drinking raw milk, but according to the CDC, the people who are most at risk for developing milk-borne illnesses are children, the elderly, and people with weakened immune systems. But coming up at 6, we speak to this nutritionist who debunks some of the common milk myths. John. Stephanie, we'll look for you then. Thank you. And